Understanding foods and cooking involves understanding water. Water is the reason for life on Earth. All living things rely on water. Water's important properties come about due to the geometry and components of the water molecule. Water is made of two hydrogen atoms sharing negatively charged electrons with one oxygen atom, forming two covalent bonds. This sharing is not equal, however, and oxygen attracts the electrons more than hydrogen. This causes the oxygen to have a slight negative charge and leaves both the hydrogens with a slight positive charge. Because of these slight charges, water molecules are sticky. Like magnets, they are attracted to their neighbors. These attractions are called hydrogen bonds. Water can make hydrogen bonds with any polar molecule that has these partial charges. Water dissolves polar substances like sugar because it makes hydrogen bonds with them. Nonpolar substances like oil cannot make hydrogen bonds and do not dissolve in water. Each water molecule is capable of making a maximum of four hydrogen bonds. These bonds are weak and are continuously forming and breaking. As the temperature rises, molecules move faster, weakening hydrogen bonds. At room temperature, water molecules are making between three and four hydrogen bonds. As water freezes, each molecule is forced to crystallize in a formation where it makes four hydrogen bonds. The resulting lattice is less dense than liquid water, which is why ice floats. Water has a high specific heat, which means it takes a lot of energy to raise its temperature. For a molecule of water in contact with the side of a pot to speed up and therefore get hotter, it needs to be torn from its association with neighboring molecules. Since water makes so many hydrogen bonds, it takes quite a bit of energy to do this. Many of the changes brought about in the kitchen happen because we, as chefs, weaken hydrogen bonds with heat when we cook. Water and its interaction with food molecules is therefore at the heart of cooking. When we understand water and its interactions, it allows us to harness water and create delicious dishes.